sharing with you some of my tips on how I wear my Heidi Das jewelry. Now, while there is no wrong way to wear it, I'm just gonna share you my tips on what I feel is most flattering. I find that um, a plain outfit, one solid color, is a perfect canvas for Heidi's jewelry because um, you're not going to get the prints interfering with the design of your necklace. Like you want the necklace to stand out, not everything to be kind of going on at the same time. So let me just show you some pieces that I would wear with this. Now first I want to show you a piece which is nice and it's okay, but you see how this is higher up and then we have all this empty space down here. Like to me, I wouldn't really wear anything rounded with a v-neck because it, it's not as flattering. Now let me show you the difference here. Now even this piece here, even though it's a similar style, look how this goes in a little bit of a v-shape. This is a very, of course, a very simple small piece, but I feel that this, this goes. And another piece I think would look nice with this jumpsuit is this one here. So you don't want to really leave tons of empty space, you know, you want it to kind of fill it in and kind of almost follow the shape of your collar. Now normally I would say, just because I'm wearing a fish shirt doesn't mean I should wear a fish necklace, but in this case, I think I would. This is called something's fishy, <laughs> but I mean, really, what can you wear with a fish neck shirt, but a fish necklace? But see how this one kind of fills in the neckline? Let me just show you another choice. And the great thing with a blouse is that, you know, you can button it tighter if you want, if you want to have it higher. This ocean um, piece, the little anchor, I think this looks really cute too with this top. But I, I kind of like, like it more buttoned up with this so that this becomes more the focus. Whoops. This little guy hooks in there like that. It's so cute. <laughs> And I'll probably pop this under the collar like this. You know, check out my leopard blouse. And because this collar is kind of low and rounded, I, I think a rounded piece goes with this. Now this necklace here is called Strokes of Genius. And I think it has to be one of my absolute favorite pieces of all. Look at the colors of this and how the light just bounces off of it. Now I want to show you a necklace that I would not wear with this. And that's this one, as beautiful as this is. I want to show you how sometimes just too, it's just too much. See this? On the leopard background and everything. I mean, it's nice, but it kind of gets kind of lost in this. Now I want to show you what this piece looks really good with. Now see how this just shows off the piece. You want the piece to be the focus, not too much going on. But this dress here, if you get a basic black dress, you can literally wear anything with it. And the great thing about um, Heidi's extenders too, is you can place your necklace exactly where you want it to go. So if I wanted this lower or higher, I can adjust it with the extender here. But you would kind of want it pretty much about there. Now let's say today I wanted to wear this printed top. Now I probably wouldn't go with a necklace with a lot of patterns or like things happening on it. I would probably go with something it's dramatic, but it's more neutral. 
So I would probably go with this. I'm just going to show you. Even though it's hella dramatic, it's beautiful, but oops. Let's try that again. Because it's like just one, um, you know, one design, if you, like, you know what I mean, one element. See how this just works? It's dramatic, but it's, you know, it doesn't overtake the top. Now there's another piece I have here, if you want to get a little crazy. This one works nice with this, but you see how we're starting to get into a little bit too much. To me, I don't, I wouldn't wear this. This is just, and now I would if I had a plain, let me just take this off here. I had a plain top on. Oops. Yeah, I know this is a dress, but being plain, you could get away with that Marcy on a black background. Now guys, let's just say I wanted to wear this pink dress today. Now a long necklace looks really good with this because it makes you look kind of elongated. I mean, I do like this higher up as well, where I usually wear most of my pieces up here. But I just want to show you guys this pin I got today from Heidi's sale. She's been having crazy, crazy sales lately. Look at this little bird. Whoops, where are we? Two lovebirds. Now look how nice the navy and the pink are together. Now if I was to wear this pin, I would wear it up here, I think. You want to wear your pins a little bit higher and with this. I think this looks cute. And guys, don't think just because you have on a blue top that you have to wear a blue or so necklace because, you know, sometimes matchy matchy isn't the best. I see how this um, nudish color necklace stands out more. like a gold and peach but you know they don't always think okay I'm wearing blue so I better wear a blue shirt I mean a blue shirt so I better wear a blue necklace because this I don't move my hair out of the way here because this I think is adorable And I really like the blouses because you really have a lot of options with them. Like you can put your pins. Let's see if I got a pin here. You can like put a pin here at the at the collar. Just one second. Well, hello. <laughs> see how dramatic this piece is. It's nothing sexier than a button-up shirt with a pin right at your neck. Now guys, if you go with a neutral base, such as a denim dress, you can pretty much go with, you have a lot of options for your jewelry. Like this piece here, I think looks cute with this. This piece is so nice. This fringe one. Um, Again, we could go with a solid color like this. This probably isn't my favorite with this, though. You know, like to me, that doesn't really look the best. Probably because it's blue and blue. This one here. 
This one's pretty. There's a reason why Heidi wears a lot of black when she's um, doing her promotions for her jewelry because it has a perfect background for her jewelry. She lets the jewelry speak more than her clothes. And I love, love, love this seahorse necklace. Now she brought this one back. I maybe sold out now. I bought this one years ago when it first came out. Um, I love how you can double this up or you can have it long. I don't wear my necklaces long a lot because I'm a little bit clumsy and I'm always worried I'm going to catch this on something and it's going to pull and it's going to go beads everywhere. So yeah, even though they're cute long, I don't wear a lot of longs. And another fashion tip I have for you is scarves. Um, if you have a patterned scarf like this one, look at this. I found this at a thrift shop. It's Belle from, you know, Disney. This is actually from Disney Parks. Um, Look at my bell pin. But yeah, if you have, um, if you want to wear like a patterned scarf, I would have the clothes neutral. And if I had on an extremely patterned outfit, I probably would have on a plain scarf. Just so it's not overwhelming, but... Isn't this cute? Like, seriously, when I saw this scarf, I was like, okay, the first thing that came to mind was my bell pin from Heidi. It's so cute. And another tip I have for you is your pins. So if you're wearing, you know, a jacket or this is one of Heidi's uh, wraps and you have a large pin, don't put it low down like this. It'll flop around, brings your eye down here where you don't want it. What you want to do is put it up high like this. Now this pin is called window dressing. I've tried to sell this a few times on my site and nobody's bought it. I don't know why. So maybe it's a sign that I need to keep it. So if I can just pin it on here, you see how it brings the attention up to your face where everything is bright and shiny and <laughs> that's what you want. So while I'm no expert, you know, I'm not a professional, these are just some tips that I've just found work for me and I get a lot of compliments on my jewelry. Heidi's jewelry so you know if we can display them the best way we can that's even better so thank you for watching guys love you give it to me like <laughs>